for a ride. It's Saturday. We want to go up to Cadillac, which is like an hour and a half to eat our at our favorite restaurant. And we're gonna check out TJ Maxx. I don't know what else. But it's really nice today, so we're going for a ride when it's not snowing and it's blizzardy out. for one of his dogs. Yeah. Maybe they didn't all come back or something. Because Coon on the night. Oh, so. Right. All the day he could be doing rabbit hunting. Different kind of dogs are there. Beagles. Is yeah, beagles are rabbits. Beagles are rabbits. Coon, coon dogs are coon. Dogs are kind of like Isn't that funny? A, a coon black, dog. Uh, black and tan. They name them coon dogs because they go for coon. The beagles go for rabbits. Squirrels. Yep, it's nice out today, guys. We're just chit chatting, driving down the road. Glad the roads are pretty much clear. Gas is three twenty four for regular and three ninety nine for whatever the other one's called. We got it for two ninety one today. Oh, yeah. Okay guys. Okay, we're almost to Cadillac. We're gonna be passing the road to what's it called now? Cabra Fay. Cabra Fay Ski Resort where I took the grandkids a couple weeks ago. And Cadillac's like another 12 miles or something. Yeah. And we're gonna go to right here's all the signs and everything. We're gonna go to Kyle's favorite restaurant. What's that restaurant? Timbers? Timbers. We're going to the Timbers and he's getting a lumberjack sandwich. I think I'm gonna get my coconut shrimp. I'm not sure, but this is where we're going. And I'll be back when we have a snowmobile track. Snowmobiles go across all the time on these roads on this snowmobile trail, so you gotta kind of watch. Yeah, they like deer. They pop out everywhere. Yeah, they like watching for deer, these snowmobilers. <laughs> but they gotta have fun too, so we let it go. So we're like way up here in the middle of nowhere. See out the window. Nothing but woods.
Okay, guys. Okay, right here's our restaurant. It's called Timbers. Good, they're not busy. And the sign says open. Yay! We wanted to come in that busy time. Everybody already got their lunch, must be. Sure they're open. Oh, right there. Timbers. Here we are. There's nobody here. This is the restaurant. It's really cool on the inside. I know I've got other videos up on it, but not driving here. Okay, we're going in. So while you're sitting here, how are you doing today, honey? Yeah, I got a fart. Uh, you're being recorded. <laughs> is this your favorite restaurant? <laughs> yeah, right now it is. So you like it. Here comes my salad. Okay, here's my salad that goes with my shrimp. There's my husband trying not to talk because he says naughty stuff. But here's the, here's what it looks like on the inside yeah, of the restaurant. Yeah, it's obvious again. If I was going to be on keto, and then I could fit my Speedo about a couple months from now. Okay, he's talking about Speedos. Okay. But anyways, this is this is the restaurant. This is the husband that that is very inappropriate for most of the part. There's a part in here that I'm going to probably cut off because he's talking about... <laughs> Stop. No, I'm talking about life in general. Okay, here's my food. I'm going to eat now. Thank you. Can anybody tell me what kind of lettuce this is? I like... It's halfway between broccoli. I like just head of lettuce. Iceberg lettuce? That's got purple, this he is it's got purple heads to it. Weird lettuce, guys. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, I got my shrimp. This is coconut shrimp, and he has a lumberjack, and he's going to pick it up and show you. That's what he likes. Lumberjack, and then there. I think it's roast beef, right? Beer battered fries, or whatever it's called. Yeah, roast it's roast beef. beef, right? Right, uh -huh. roast beef. And it's his favorite. Yum. Mm -hmm. Was it worth the hour and a half drive? Mm -hmm. Okay, you like it. Oh, we're good. We'll be back. Okay, they fixed my salad. They brought me a good one. And then he's eating a sandwich and making a mess like a sloppy Joe. These French fries are delicious, and this is really good. I've already tasted one. And this is a coconut dip too, or a sweet dip. Anyways, there's our food. There's Kyle. There we go. We're going to eat. Okay. Okay, we just left the restaurant. It was really, really good. Was it good, Kyle? Oh, uh, yeah. Awesome. And now we're going to TJ Maxx. And maybe Dollar Tree. I might go to Dollar Tree real quick to see what they got. Because we're in a different town. Okay, guys. Be back. Oh, oh I missed that whole building. Okay, we're downtown Cadillac. I already went out to eat, and we went to TJ Maxx in the Dollar Tree. And we're just, this is where my mom grew up, so this is her, like her stomping ground. I don't like how close you are to vehicles. Right. Somebody go close to your the side. People won't park next to the snowbank. They don't want to get snow on their tire. There's a pawn shop. There ain't that much snow all year, really. There's a pawn shop back here. I can't believe it. Oh, yeah, it's Saturday. That's why the pawn shows on. I don't know why I feel like it's Sunday. Bunch of little old stores. There's a Cadillac 4. It's a theater. Right there. Now, that was the old part of town, and then they got a different part of town. Which we were already down by Myers and um, all the, the restaurants. It used to be down here in the corner. Well, if you go down this road right up here, Kyle, no, we went to the health department. Got my shot the other day. It's over the railroad tracks, and then we turn right there where it says cast iron kitchen. We turned there and then went down, and that's where I got my poke. No, that's where they used to be Ponderosa right there. Is this the road? No, it's down farther. It's the Ponderosa Steakhouse back in the 80s. Well, somehow, anyways, there was a road we went and turned down. We might have passed it. But anyways, guys, we're going to head out of Cadillac and head home. We had a nice time. And I'll do a little on the way home, too. Be back. Right up here is Lake Cadillac. We'll pass these houses first. See, they're gone, too. The dry was not close. Right there's ice fishermen out there on the lake. Mark said Minnesota, they just drive all their vehicles out there and have a power out in the middle of the lake, all their vehicles. <laughs> they get days off, please. 
Oh, look at the snowmobile. There's a snowmobile coming on the ice box. There goes the snow. Two of them. There goes snowmobiles right there. Boom. Out having fun. There's a couple of tents out there side by side. What are they called? Fish shanties. Okay. Yeah. Just looks like a tent. That's the fish shanty. Like, yeah, that are like made out of wood yeah, or something. Yeah, there's people on the middle out there. Okay. They're out there. Right. Right. I wonder if anybody in your family back in the day ice fished. Sure they did. Right there, that blue building over there is, I think, your, a restaurant right there on the lake. Your great great grandfather, honey, over here. I wonder if you would fish. Oh, I'm sure. My grandpa, my great great grandpa George, probably. Yeah, the one that was logo over here, the Ouija board. <laughs> right, I'm sure he fished over here. Yep, this yep, is where my great, grandma and my mom was raised. Right where that Dollar General is now, there used to be a restaurant. <laughs> used to be a restaurant right there where the Dollar General is. Yeah, back in right the there. 80s. Right there is a, I think it's a blue restaurant right there on the water. It's probably not open this time of year, but yeah. that's a restaurant. Right there. One shanty right there, huh? Mm -hmm, but I thought it'd be more. I'm shanties out there. But there's quite a few, but all spread out. More of them on the other lake, though. Yeah, that right there. Is that a restaurant? Yeah, it says restaurant. Yeah, that one is too. I never been to that one. Me neither. Oh, it's got lights on, so it is open year round. There's a restaurant to the back side. Look at all the turkeys. Look at them, look at them, look at them. <laughs> right in the middle of the road. Hey, it's like a whole herd of like 25 of them right there. Right. Now this is the area on Maple Island when they supposedly have their sightings. So we're kind of just going down this road to see if we see any. Right but we're almost home. Right there at the McLaren Lake. One side of it. Well, you we can't really see it right now. Oh, the guy and his dog, right? Well, the houses yeah. are on the way. Right, there is a lake. There it is over there. I see it. Okay, see the lake. You can see where the house is in the way, right? Right. Stupid birds flying in the middle of the road. What's wrong with you birds? I call them dodo birds. Right here, this curve over there is the lake right down there, too. Why they didn't build a bridge? They just, made a <laughs> just made a curve around the lake. These should go around. Right. Uh, it's a COD corner. Come over, darling. Yay. This used to be like a 
you a story of dollar stuff that's out there? Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Long New stuff? Ago. Yeah. Like, my first move. Well, no. It's even before I moved in here. so like 35 years ago. So. But yeah, see, they could come down here to get whatever. Yep, here we are, coming into town. Over there's the dam. I remember going to the Hudson River Variety Store. Right there. And this all froze over over here. Yeah. That's frozen too. Yeah, it's a river. You know, I still, here's our big bad town. It's really a village. That's why I keep saying town. I keep saying town, it's a village. But in our village, we do have a bar right there. It's called Angelo's and Ricardo's. Right there. That used to be my mom's hair salon. Angelo's Cardo's. And we have an antique store right there. And they have a health food store on that side. Automotive. Not much. And we're done. Right over there is the doctor's there office. There's a doorway. That restaurant. Anybody wants to open a restaurant? That restaurant's for sale. And we have three gas stations, and that's one. And there's our big beautiful library. It is great too. Oh, my husband's got checklists. His Jeep's in. But anyways, that's our town. Okay guys, we're almost home. We pray for me, I pray for you, we pray for the world. There's the park. Library. If anybody wants to buy a restaurant, we got one for sale. And the restaurant for sale.